Okay, today we're going to be demonstrating the shoot through distal humerus view. The views that we did previously to this would be the AP as is humerus and the transthoracic humerus. Okay, so the view here that we're going to be doing is just a shoot through, and this is to see the distal third of the humerus. Okay, this is on a patient who's unable to move their arm uh, or something like that, so we're going to take and do a shoot through to see it. So the patient's going to be lying supine on the table. We're going to use an 11 by 14. Uh, film size lengthwise. Our technique's going to be, we're going to actually go down just a little bit in the technique. We're probably going to use something like uh, about 8 at 57 uh, because we're only seeing the distal part. So it's more of the distal humerus and then part of the elbow. So if the patient can keep their arm bent, if they can do that, we'll try to get it bent. If they can't, we can lay it out flat, whatever which way the patient can. We're going to get as close as we can to the film. The film will go up into the axilla as far as it can possibly go. And then we're basically going to center to where just when we get the collimation, and we'll extend it here so we can sort of get an idea. I'm going to move it up and down the arm until when my collimation comes in, it goes to the elbow, and we've also got to the top of the film. Okay, so I've got as far up this way as I can. I think I need to come in just a tad bit more. And then I've got past the elbow and I'm just to the top of the film. So I'm not exposing anything I don't need to be exposing here. Film or the marker placement that's going to go on top here, right arm. So we have got, then we do have uh, as much of the humor as we can, which is the distal third, which is what we want to see. We have the bend of the elbow, we have the joint space because the humerus is a long bone, so we have to have both joint spaces. We are including that. Again, our technique on this is going to be somewhere around uh, 8 uh, mass at 55 to 57 kV. And this is our shoot through trauma humerus view.